Good afternoon, this is Pam Gaither with the Galesburg Area Chamber of Commerce, and we are visiting this afternoon with Jeannie Conlon and Harold Timmons out at the airport. Um, what are we celebrating soon on uh, Thursday? We are celebrating business after hours, and we're going to be out here at the International Stearman Community Center at the Galesburg Municipal Airport. And it's the new hangar that was recently opened in the last year, right? That is correct, and yes. we're pleased to say we've got phase two that's going on right now, and hopefully will be completed by Thursday. Yes. That's our plan. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's a good plan. I think, I think you're going to keep everybody in mind for that to work out. So we you might. gave me a sneak peek. This is, it's wonderful what's happened since the last time we were here. Mm -hmm. A lot of progress. It's, it is virtually complete. On and the first floor. On the first floor, which is, as you mentioned, phase one and phase two. Phase one, of course, was the building, the steel building. Phase two then was putting all of these offices so that we could use that building. And uh, then phase three, which will, our campaign for that will begin at the National Stearman Flight and first week is, or starts the Labor Day. Sure. Stearman. Well, we're all excited about that too. That's yes. coming right up. It yeah. is. So you have showed, this is all new. We're actually in the conference room on the first floor right now. You can see behind us they, they installed the, the posters from all the years in the past and the new one I just saw, the new poster. So I know some of you are anxiously awaiting that. It'll be available soon, right? Yes, it will be. Uh, we'll have them here at Jet Air for sale, and it'll also be at the Tourism Bureau. Absolutely. Good information to know. We usually get a few phone calls about that. Mm -hmm. uh, so a lot of people getting excited about the event. And the Business After Hours is just a time to showcase this space again, now that you've got the first phase completed. Um, and I think that's going to be exciting. We'll actually be in the hangar next week. So Business After Hours is Thursday, August. 18th 5 to 7 and I will put the link for RSVPing in the comments and probably in the description as well once I'm able to get back in the office and take care of that but if you haven't RSVP yeah we definitely want you here right we do and we'll have lots of our Stearman fly-in board members some from out of state and we will also have Stearman Foundation board members here so we'll give tours of the facility and let everybody see what's going on kind of an early peek before the fly-in happens, right? Exactly right. And it is. Yeah, so Harold, we were talking a little bit here. This this hangar itself, how it came about, and you and I have talked about this before at the ribbon cutting last year, but just a reminder for those that maybe aren't familiar with how, how it came about and who all had a hand in making that happen. Well, certainly the Galesburg community, and as I mentioned a while ago, basically there were several groups. The, the city of Galesburg, really went overboard to help us with uh, a good lease on the, on the land and uh, helped us with some of the uh, things uh, like water and, sure. and, and storm sewers. The, the city stepped up and did that for us uh, because that's their property, that's their responsibility. And then the aviation community, uh, or I call it the aviation especially for, for general aviation airplanes, the, air, the kind of airplanes that people own, that's worldwide because uh, we've had donations and contributions, some sizable, from all over the world for this building. You mentioned Switzerland, Germany, Germany I mean all over, France, yes. France, New, uh, 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 New, New Zealand. Zealand uh, and you were able to build this space from donations completely. This is entirely from donations. And, and everything that is completed to this point has all been paid for. It is paid for. So <laughs> that is impressive. It's still <laughs> impressive to hear. That's amazing. You were able to raise the funds and make this happen. Mm -hmm. um, that's that's a testament to the dedication of what you mentioned, the worldwide aviation family and the people of our community that support this event mm -hmm. and what you do. So, Harold, I mean, it's a huge, it says a lot for what you stand for as well. Um, I say this every time. I tell people when I meet them, if they haven't ever been out here, they need to beat you, and they need to come out to the Stearman fly -in. So, yes, so the Stearman fly -in is coming up the week of Labor Day, starting on Labor Day, right? Starts on Labor Day, September 5th, and goes through the 10th. 
Um, if you come to business after hours, we'll have our sheets to sign up volunteers. So I was going to ask you if we would be any. really excited. Yay. People would like to volunteer, so lots of different opportunities yes. there. So I will be signing up. Awesome. I'm very excited about that. I've been looking forward to it, I think, since last year. So I'm definitely going to help. So if anybody is interested in helping, absolutely, definitely a good time to talk about that. Um, and so I did want to mention, so the, it's, the Business After Hours is actually sponsored by the National Chairman Fly-In and the Foundation. Mm -hmm. So I think that people get confused. There are the two separate entities, mm -hmm. um, and one serves the purpose of the event, one serves the purpose of fundraising. Correct. That's correct. Yeah, yeah. Anything else you want to add, Carol? Well, I thought of a comment a minute ago on that, uh, when you were talking about selling the posters. Every year, we send those out. People that can't make the flying yes. all over the world send an, uh, a note, ask us to send them a poster sure. because it's. Uh, I, I know one time I was in New Zealand and uh, walking down between the hangars, just like here, and run onto a couple of guys that had a Stearman airplane in the hangar, and in their hangar was most of these oh my posters. Gosh. <laughs> In, uh, wow. in New Zealand, and they knew me. They saw that me so come. Awesome. Out. Well, yes, of course they yeah, knew they Errol. <laughs> come on out, hey! Oh Errol my Miller. gosh, you're a celebrity. Errol's a celebrity. He is. No. You are legendary for sure. Yeah, it's yeah. Um, it's a, this is such a special event, and to me, and I have a small child, uh, my youngest, who just loves loves to come out, and Good. so he's looking forward to it. And I know a lot of people in the community are looking forward to the fly-in. So. Thank you for continuing all of the amazing work you both do. And um, I am so excited for that event. And the business after hours, like we said, you'll get to kind of have a little early peek at things. Some of the renovations that they've completed now, it looks wonderful. It's just, it's very sharp and clean and just perfect. So I know if you know this guy, it's gonna be good stuff. So um, that heating system that you showed me, impressive. Um, it's, it's just top notch. So we hope you're able to make it out so you guys can see this and chat with Jeannie and Harold and some of the board members as well. One other thing, yeah. we will be giving away two um, things at the Business After Hours. One is a framed poster of this year's poster. Wonderful. And we'll be giving away a steerman ride. So oh my gosh. another incentive for people yeah. to come out. A steerman ride. Be drawn for a steerman ride. Wow, that yeah. is quite an incentive right there. Mm -hmm. Wow. Know, I have to make a comment. I mean, yes. Jeannie is the the premier organizer. It, it, uh, I do the groundwork and get things fixed and help put it together, but when it comes to organizing and getting everybody going in a direction, that's her job. She does a great job. She does. And how long have you been at the helms of the organization? I've been involved with the organization since 1995. Um, I was the president for about a seven-year term and then took a couple-year hiatus and then came back. I think this is my third or fourth year as president again. Wonderful. Mm -hmm. I've been involved since 1971. Well, <laughs> since the founding. Yes, and thank goodness for that. Yes. So yeah. we are so grateful. I'm really excited. Again, I'm going to put the RSVP link in the comments. So if you haven't, please let us know you're coming so we can make sure to have a head count that they need um, just to make sure they're, you know, ready for everyone who's attending. Thank you so much. It's so good. Always good to see both of you. Thank you very yeah. much, Pam. Yes. Have a good weekend. Good to see you. Yeah, you Thanks too. for coming out. Yeah, absolutely. Thanks. Thank you. Look forward to seeing you on Thursday. Yes.